वालेकुम नाजरीन गुड आफ्टरनून वेलकम टू फूड डायरीज थैंक्स गिविंग स्पेशल जैसा कि आपको पता है हर साल हम यू एस काउंसिल जनरल को यहाँ इन्वाइट करते हैं अपने शो पे और वो आते हैं और वो हमारे साथ मज़े मज़े की रेसिपीज़ शेयर करते हैं तो वही ट्रेडिशन को साथ साथ चलाते हुए हम आज भी जो करंट यू एस काउंसिल जनरल हैं स्कॉट अर्बॉन साहब उनको हमने बुलाया है यहाँ और रेवा गुप्ता उनको भी हमने इन्वाइट किया है फूड डायरीज़ के सेट पर तो वेलकम टू मसाला टी Thank you it's great to be here. Thank you for coming spending out the time. So we've got uh, a lovely uh, turkey planned out today. <laughs> That's one turkey dinner. I love Thanksgiving. Great. And uh, how long have you been in Karachi? I just arrived here at the uh, end of August so just a few months. Okay. What about you Reva? I arrived here in October okay. uh, in Karachi. Acha Reva uh, Urdu bhi jaanti hai to hum unse yeah. Urdu mein baat karenge. Theek hai. Theek hai. Theek. Okay. So uh, aap logo ne koi Pakistani cuisine try kiya hai abhi tak? Bilkul. Kya khaya? <laughs> वैसे तो गोलगप्पे खाए बिरयानी यहाँ का बिरयानी ज़बरदस्त है um, और भी uh, क्या क्या खाए um, different uh, handies and things like that मिठाई हाँ ओ मिठाई तो हाँ जी <laughs> okay what about you Scott I love Pakistani food. Okay, have I you tried something? I think their uh, biryani is my favorite. Biryani is um, like universal love. Every <laughs> every Friday at the consulate, we all go to the cafeteria and we that's have biryani. Oh, that's great. That's great. And then I've also enjoyed just getting out and trying some of the restaurants here. Mm-hmm. Um I went with the ambassador a few weeks ago to Boat Basin for a traditional Karachi oh, breakfast and that was one great. of my most memorable experiences. That's great. So tell us how do you spend Thanksgiving in your country? Mm-hmm. Well, for me Thanksgiving is my favorite holiday because it's a time when we get together not christmas we get presents. all the presents i love christmas too but <laughs> i don't like the pre- the pressure of presents, presents. buying presents mm. and so thanksgiving's nice because you don't have to worry about presents you just get together with family and friends mm-hmm. you enjoy a good meal um it's it's a great holiday and what about yeah. you baba i think i feel the same way it is the best holiday in the sense that i love food and i love hanging out with my friends and family and so it's this confluence of everything that i love without the pressures of yeah. so what aap, aap log bhi thanksgiving isi tarah manate hain ki aap log kuch aur pakate hain actually hum kuch thoda fusion pakate hain to waise aa is saal mera bhai uh aam ki achar se कुछ बना रहा है टर्की के रब के लिए oh, really? तो उससे वो ग्रेवी भी बना दे, बना देगा और इतना ज़बरदस्त स्वाद है जब हम ऐसे तरह की hmm. के के खाना बनाते हैं एक्चुअली कुछ साल पहले हमने लहसन की अचार की की टर्की बनाई hmm. वो भी ज़बरदस्त था और स्नैकिंग के लिए हम कभी कभी भेल पूरी बनाते हैं कभी कभी गोलगप्पे भी बनाते हैं कभी कभी हम वो जो स्किन है टर्की या चिकन का वो बेक करते हुए उसके बाद हम चाट मसाला बन ओ माय गॉड ऊपर माय माउथ इज वाटरिंग हां इट्स डिलीशियस यस ओके दैट्स ग्रेट सो व्हाट आर वी मेकिंग टुडे इन माय शो सो आई थिंक वी आर मेकिंग अ ट्रेडिशनल थैंक्सगिविंग मील ऑफ कोर्स द टर्की दैट्स द सेंटर पीस बट वी आर आल्सो गोइंग टू मेक स्टफिंग and green beans okay. and then for dessert we have a pumpkin pie reva aaj bahut hi kind enough hai ki unhone mere show ke liye mere liye ek pumpkin pie banaya hai aur hum bhi try karenge taste karenge aur wo pura samjhayenge ki kis tarah banaya hai because pumpkin ka hum soch ke kehte hain kaddu meethe mein dalenge kaisa lagega you know kaddu ka naam sun ke bhag jate hain log but pumpkin pie is a traditional dessert jo ye serve karte hain ya fir apple pie ho ya is tarah ka kuch to maine socha apple pie to hum bana chuke hain apne show pe bhi we made apple pie on the show many times so uh, we thought it would be a very nice uh, thing to you know make mm. uh, pumpkin pie and because ye bana ke laye hain to aaj hum khana banayenge mm-hmm. aur phir bahut maze maze ki inke sath baatein bhi karenge to chale chalte hain hum kitchen ki taraf aur aap se kitchen mein mulakat hogi ओके जी तो नाजरीन हम आ गए हैं किचन में और यहाँ हमारे साथ रेवा गुप्ता हैं और यहाँ है हमारे साथ काउंसिल जनरल यूएसए के जो यहाँ कराची में अभी पोस्ट हुए हैं स्कॉट अबॉम उनके साथ हम थैंक्स गिविंग का ये स्पेशल शो करने वाले हैं आप सोचेंगे मैंने ऑलरेडी क्या रख दिया है चूल्हे पे सो दैस सम वाटर टू ब्लांश द green beans now over to these two lovely people because i'm going to take a break today all right yes <laughs> thank you so we're starting with green beans and mushroom sauce we're going to start by blanching the green beans okay. in some boiling water for a couple minutes okay and then we'll start uh, making the mushroom sauce okay so garam pani mein humne bas beans ko dal diya hai wahan ek bowl mein thanda pani hai baraf ka usme hum unko blanch kar denge taki uska cooking process khatam ho jaye 
Okay. Then what do we want Reva to start with? Why don't we? Yeah, I can start with the uh, mushroom sauce. Do you okay. want to hand me some butter? Okay. And there then, you thank you. Um, yeah, we just need to turn on the. There we go. Yeah. Right. Just press it. Press it. Butter knife, please. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So we're gonna add. Ham dalenge thoda sa. Thoda sa makhan. थोड़ा ज़्यादा भी हो जाए तो कोई बात नहीं हमें ज़रूरत है हाँ और थैंक्सगिविंग डिनर पर हम सोचते नहीं हैं हाँ डाइट वाइट का नहीं सोचे थैंक्सगिविंग ठीक है और फिर मैं ये यहाँ पर डाल दूँगी और थोड़ा सा एंड देन वी पुट सम अनियंस इन देयर आई थिंक द फ्लावर फर्स्ट या प्लीज फ्ला� and then we'll put the onions in. So we're going to make a little bit so of a roux. Spoon, spoon yeah. is there. Yeah, can I get a spoon from you? There you go. Thank you. So do you Let's cook uh, with your family like this only in the kitchen I... on Thanksgiving? So on Thanksgiving, I'm going to do a little bit of a work. My brother and my brother are the best cooks in family. Mein sabse cooks hai. So, yes. So they, we rely on them to be the cooks in the family. Okay. Um, let me grab Especially this for you, Scott. Mm -hmm. <laughs> let me just start. And the green beans are blanched, so I'm going to Put drain this. Okay. You have a strainer. Uh, wait, wait, wait. Actually, Scott, why do, do you want to take the, hmm. the yeah. green beans with the, um, what is this thing? Put called? them in the water here. Yeah, like that. Put yeah. Them, just drain them okay. and I'll put drain them back. Them, yeah. And then I'll put them Mind in the cold water. Okay. 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 Yeah, and then put them in the water. Let's right. them. Now we're gonna put in some onions. Okay, tikka. Tikka. So, आपने देखा थोड़ा प्याज. Scotch ने वो ठंडे पानी के bowl में डाल दिया है ताकि वो अच्छी तरह ठंडे हो जाएं. Okay. We'll leave them here. How long? Just just a few minutes. They'll cool off, okay. and then when, when, once the sauce is ready, mm -hmm. we'll mix it all together in a dish. Okay. The cheese and mushrooms and the make a lovely mushrooms. green bean mushroom casserole. Yes. Mm -hmm. Ooh, my mouth yeah. is watering. It is delicious. It is really very delicious. Turkey already in the oven. Great. Mm -hmm. And uh, actually, mushrooms. Can you pass me the mushrooms, mm -hmm. Scott? Okay. So yeah. once the onions are done, we yep. put the mushrooms. Yep. We basically cook the onions thodi der ke liye. Okay. Um, fir thoda sa mushroom dal de. फिर इसमें actually नमक भी actually नमक and then फिर उसके बाद दूध okay so milk हाँ थोड़ा सा मैं अंदाज़ा से कर रही हूँ अभी how much milk do you need um let's let's give it just start pouring we're doing this as we say in Andaze se. In uh, in South Asia, we say andaze se. It's yeah. like and what does you're that mean? just kind uh, of as per your uh, your eye. Yeah, yeah, the eye. Yeah. <laughs> so you don't want all the mushrooms. Um, we can add some more mushrooms, and then let's add some salt too. Should I add? Yeah, it's please. Thode se ho jayenge, na? Garlicha. And then we're probably going to need a little more, more milk. butter. I mean, milk, sorry. <laughs> more milk coming up. What I love about Thanksgiving is that you cook together, yeah. right? With yeah. your family, your friends. In my home, my <laughs> wife and my daughters, who are now in college, okay. we always start our morning by, you know, in the kitchen, starting to make the, the sweet potatoes, get the turkey in the oven, and it's just a family activity throughout the day. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah, and everyone's sort of giving their contribution as to, maybe that needs a little more pepper, maybe mm. that needs a little more milk. Do you want some pepper? That we've got you. Yes, we will definitely add some pepper in here. Thank you. Well, I'll do a little bit of work today. I'm not rest day. Yes, I'll do a little bit of work. What do you think about it? What do you add? Since it's everybody's uh, dinner. <laughs> I don't know. I think the cheese and then some herbs, I guess. Ah, yeah? cheese. Let's put some cheese in. <laughs> All right, we'll put some and cheese in now, and then we'll, mm. I think we'll top it at the end with some more cheese. Yes, yes. Okay. that'll be a great idea. Right. So, should I give you the casserole? Yeah. Well, yeah, and then we can put the beans in the casserole, and then we'll put the sauce on top. All right, I think the beans are cooled off, so I'm going to drain these. Okay. Okay. 
वैसे तो मेरे फैमिली में हम इतना ज्यादा नमक नहीं डालते हैं आजकल और बटर सॉल्टेड वो चीज भी उसके अंदर भी नमक है तो हम बस वैसे तो जैसे मैं कह रही हूँ हम अंदाजे से थोड़ा सा कभी कभी हेल्थी करते हैं आपने क्या बन रही है हल्दी कहा से चली गई नहीं 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 चलो ये आई थिंक लुक्स ग्रेट या या बंद आई थिंक वी टर्न दिस ऑफ यस लेट्स स्कॉट यू वांट टू पुट दोस इन टू द डिश ओके एंड देन पैन ओ डियर इट्स राइट टेक आउट द आइस क्यूब्स इट्स राइट लिटिल बिट वोंट हर्ट ओके राइट और फिर हम ये पूरा सास डाल देंगे इस क्यूब पर ओके ग्रेट डू वांट एनी मोर मिल्क और एनीथिंग आई डोंट थिंक सो या यू वांट एनीथिंग एल्स ऑन टॉप ओके द चीज विल गो एंड देन वी टॉप इट विद सम चीज ओके एंड देन सम प्रोबब्ली सम हर्ब्स वी गॉट सम हर्ब्स यस एंड वी बेसिकली यू कैन एक्चुअली मेक इट डिफरेंट वेज वैसे तो यू कैन मेक इट very uh soupy or you can make it less so depending on your flavor and your family like a cream of mushroom <laughs> soup on top like a cream of mushroom yeah. soup on top all right ready for the cheese yep let's do it scott <laughs> so fun celebrating thanksgiving with and you and then it this is. will go in the oven <laughs> for how long love this holiday till the cheese is melted yeah. yeah basically the cheese gets golden brown on top and gets gooey the way we love cheese yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Is that enough or is that it? That sounds yeah, good. good. That right. looks really okay. good. Let's add just a few little herbs on top. We use this, this one. Okay. So then we'll just add. So you're from India, or your parents were from India. Yes. You were born in the States. So do you uh, speak uh, other than Hindi any other dialect? Gujarati, English, Urdu, what? So my family speaks Marwadi. Marwadi, okay. But I can't say. From Rajasthan. Ha. Huh? Okay. My family is from Rajasthan. So with my brother. I think the both of us together we can understand and communicate with somebody. Okay. We're a two person communicating <laughs> operation when it comes to Marwari. Okay. <laughs> but uh but I love Rajasthan. Um it's and I'm very excited at some point to be able to see hopefully the Thar Desert here mm. and to go over there. Okay, so, so this goes in the oven. Yep, we'll okay. put this in the oven. So I'll put I'm putting you to work. Oven. Yes, I'll put this <laughs> in the oven and we'll take a short break when we come back we'll do uh, the stuffing. Okay? Sounds so good. So we'll do the stuffing or turkey ke sath stuffing to hamesha hoti hai ek sauce bhi hota hai. Ye is tarah ke casseroles hote hain, sabziyan hoti hain. Mm -hmm. So aapne kahi nahi jana hai, hamare sath rahiye, dekhte rahiye. Ye Thanksgiving special show of Food Diaries only on Masala TV. नाजरीन ब्रेक से हम वापस आ गए हैं और यहाँ अब स्कॉट हमें बनाना सिखाएंगे स्टफिंग सो स्कॉट टेल एस मोर अबाउट द स्टफिंग नाउ स्टफिंग इज वन ऑफ ट्रेडिशनल डिशेस वन ऑफ माय फेवरेट डिशेस ऑन थिंग्सगिविंग सो वर गोइंग टू टेक ब्रेड कट इट अप इन द स्मॉल क्यूब्स एंड रेबा विल हेल्प उस डूबेट आई विल स्टार्ट and then we'll mix it all together and we'll bake it. Now, stuffing it can actually go inside the turkey while you're baking the turkey or you can cook it separately. I I prefer just to do it separately. Okay. Um but some families like to put the inside mm, the turkey full the of stuffing. Yeah. <laughs> all right. So we're going to add so Once let, the butter melts, we once add that melts, we'll onions. add our our onions. Okay, great. Okay. Is this correct sizing about that's 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 great you could go so even cubes. even a little smaller okay, okay. yeah so riva okay. lots of work for you yes keeping i keeping you busy keeping me busy <laughs> always and, and you can also add there's so many variations of okay. stuffing okay tell some us more like about the variations apple some people okay. put raisins maybe raven your family you have a, your own variation yeah we use um basmati rice okay. we use cinnamon cloves uh celery a lot of different vegetables Um my brother actually has started a cornbread stuffing as mm, well wow. so there's Sounds all kinds wonderful. lovely variety yes. yeah. <laughs> Okay so there go in our onions in the melted butter Okay Let's take a couple mm. minutes saute saute the onions okay. we'll add some celery as well Okay Celery cut ke dal di pyaaz dal diya makhan mein What is your favorite uh stuffing what sort of 
a stuffing is your favorite? So at home, we, we just make a traditional stuffing, but we usually add raisins just to add oh. a little bit of sweetness to it. What about cranberries? Cranberries are great too. Mm -hmm. Now, another traditional dish is cranberry sauce. Sauce, the sauce, So yeah. <laughs> my wife and I love to just make the separate sauce and then that goes really well with the turkey. You yeah. know, kind of the sweet and yeah. the savory together. And of course, mashed potatoes, mm. another popular dish. <laughs> mashed potatoes, you, you do at the end, right before you know the turkey's uh, coming out of the oven, you start boiling your potatoes. That's the last dish you make. But the stuffing, usually, you start making a few hours before yeah. um, because it takes a bit longer to bake. Okay. okay. What next? So I'm going to add the garlic. Mm -hmm. Okay, what next? Okay. Mm -hmm. So give this. Maybe another minute or two okay, we have to, to saute, saute okay. and then I'll start adding some herbs and spices, pepper, salt, okay. um, thyme, okay. oregano, okay. rosemary. We've got a good assortment of spices And then what about here. the bread? It'll go in the last? So then we'll put all the bread in a large bowl mm -hmm. and we'll pour this onto the bread. It kind of soaks in all that, the butter, okay. the onions, the garlic. Um, and then we're also going to mix up some eggs with some broth. We have got chicken broth there. Yes. And that will go um, also into the bowl, oh, and then we we'll put it in the oven. Oh, great! Could I get a bowl actually to start putting this bread in there, and then we can start this doing it. Right. Thank you. That We're works. Start adding some spices. Two points. Give a small spoon. Perfect. Mm -hmm. So just a little black pepper. Okay. Oh, it's looking so good, Scott. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I love the smell and mm. taste of stuffing. Yes. All right, some salt. Two spoonfuls of that. Yeah. Now this is my first Thanksgiving in my 23 years of marriage um, without my wife oh. and my two daughters. They're oh they're oh. together this week in Northern Virginia, but I'm happy that I've got my family at the see consulate. The show. Yes, they can see uh, the show. And they can see the show. <laughs> um, but I will be home with them for the Christmas holiday. Okay, I'm going home great. in a few weeks to see them. Okay. Mm -hmm. So now what else goes in? All right. Now it's time for some herbs. So I'm going to actually I'm going to cut up. Some thyme. I'm sorry, rosemary. Okay. She can we? Uh, can just yeah. take it off like this. There you yeah. go. That's fine. Okay. Okay. This fresh rosemary. If you don't have it, you can dry it too. But the the aroma of fresh really nice rosemary is exactly. really great. All right. Some thyme. Am I doing a good job, sir? Perfect. That's just the right size. You can't Perfect. wait. Can't wait to try this. All right. And then we also have some oregano. Okay. Wipe your hands. Okay. It's mm -hmm. Perfect. Okay. I think these are just about ready. So I'm gonna turn my attention over to the eggs and the broth. I'll turn this off. So if we put the eggs in the hot uh, onion, actually we're not going to no. we're not going to do the. Egg. It'll just scramble. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> we're, not, we're not scrambling eggs. Uh, do you have a fork? I'll uh, mix those up. Perfect. Okay. And then um, I'll add stock. Two cups of the stock. Okay. And then we're going to mix everything into that large bowl. Okay. I think that's more than enough the bread. You I think, think I think yeah. that should be yeah, good. I think yeah. That sounds enough. good. Yeah. Yep. We can always add more if, if we need it. But okay. Okay. Exactly. All right. Okay, so the soup and the yeah. So the bread, the, the bread will soak up a lot of this moisture. Yes. All right. So let me start with this. Moisture and flavor. Mm. I love being able to cook with butter. So my wife does not <laughs> like butter. So at home we usually use um, olive oil. Yeah. But it um, won't but, give the same taste. It's not quite the same taste. I, butter is... I, I love the taste of butter. Yeah, so do I. <laughs> All right, so mix this up and then we can go ahead and add the broth. Should I? Yeah. Please. All of it? Yeah. Broth and the eggs. Do you want more broth? We've got. I think we're good for now. Let's just see. Okay, now we need a dish. And now let's get a dish, a deep, okay. a deep dish. Um, we could even add, could probably add a little bit more bread. Yeah. What do you think? You can never have enough stuffing. The yeah, great thing about Thanksgiving is that you eat a lot, but then you always have leftovers. Mm -hmm. And so yes. for the next few days, 
you have leftover turkey, making leftover turkey sandwiches. Mm -hmm. Turkey sandwiches. Um, so it's the meal that keeps on giving. Mm. It is. It's also a nice time just to, to take a break from work and school and, and give thanks. Yeah. So one of my traditions at home is bef as, we, as we're sitting down to eat our Thanksgiving meal, we go around the table mm. and we each say what we're thankful for. Oh, that's great. And it's something Lovely. I think a lot of American families do that because okay. it, is, it is a holiday where we want to appreciate all the things that we, uh, we're fortunate to okay. have. Do you want anything else now in this? No. No, okay. I think that's it. We can, yeah. Actually, let's get the. Yes, yes. Don't yeah, want to waste those good guys. onions yeah. and celery. Yes. <laughs> no wastage in food diaries. I'm always using spatulas and taking out things Perfect. from the bowls, and I think my audience will be tired of doing seeing me do that. <laughs> I think a little bit of more. I think stock. we should add a little yeah. bit. Just exactly. A little, yeah. Yeah. You want to make sure that all the bread is a little bit yeah, moist. Soaked. Moist. Bus? Yes. Bus. I think bus. Bus. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Actually, it's true. You know, a lot of Americans um, take this day and they go to um, feed people that need uh, meals, and people will mm. deliver turkeys to people's homes. So it's it's a day, it's a day of, of service. Yeah. It's a day of service mm -hmm. and okay. a day of giving thanks. Anything else to go on this? No, no. Now straight we, in the oven. We put it straight in the oven. Mm -hmm. Okay. And all right. So okay. You can put this in the oven, please. Why do you take a break? We'll take a break, and we'll see you soon on. Masala TV. जी तो हम ब्रेक से वापस आ गए हैं और यहाँ टर्की मजेदार सी कलर देखिए बेहतरीन इसका ऊपर से कलर भी आया है और नाइस एंड परफेक्टली ब्राउन लुक्स परफेक्ट ओके जो टर्की को हमने जब बेक किया था तो उसका जो सॉस निकला था ड्रिपिंग्स जो थे जो उसकी ग्रेवी निकली थी वो हमने कलेक्ट कर दी है एक बोल में और उसको फिर हम सीजी साहब बनाएंगे इसके मजेदार सा सॉस ग्रेवी yeah, just press it, yeah. All right. Just press it. So now that the turkey's out of the oven, is it's cooling off, we will make the gravy. So we'll just start with a little bit of butter in the saucepan. Lots of butter on Thanksgiving. Lots of butter. Lots of butter. <laughs> Not the healthiest meal, but it's so tasty. <laughs> All right. And then uh, I'll add a little bit of flour once this butter melts. Okay. Um, and then we'll add the, the drippings. That's yep. what really gives it that, that delicious flavor. Yeah. Along with some salt Smells and pepper. Smells lovely. And the great thing about gravy is you can put it on the turkey, you can put it on your mashed potatoes and your stuffing. Mm -hmm. You can just put it on anything you want. Yeah, exactly. And it has all the flavors of what we yeah. marinated yeah. the turkey with. <laughs> Let me know when you're ready. All right. Saute the flour with the butter for a while. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yep. If we don't have enough stock, we can always use uh, chicken stock. Yes. All right, so. let's go ahead and add the drippings. Okay, there you go. Oh, that looks so good. And now we'll just let it simmer for a minute, mm -hmm. but let me, I'm gonna add a little bit of pepper and salt okay. to it. Okay. So our uh, green bean casserole is ready, our turkey is ready. The stuffing is getting nice and crusty in our oven mm -hmm. and the gravy is also ready. So we've got a perfect meal. Now what about dessert, Reba? So for dessert, we tend to make pumpkin pie. And okay. I have realized that the CG and I share this love of pumpkin pie. So I searched far and wide and found pumpkin puree to make a pumpkin pie with. Oh. So I made a pumpkin pie for us today. Oh, that's great. How mm. kind of you to bring it for us. Of course. And you must have added some special pumpkin pie spice in it. Yes. So my family, actually, we put elaichi also mm. in the crust and cardamom uh, cardamom in okay. the crust, okay. uh, as well as cinnamon and then cloves. Um, and then we also put cinnamon, cloves, and ground ginger in the pumpkin okay. mix, okay. in the puree. Okay. And so we'll get some okay. tasting so of that So you put some end. cream on top? And then yes, yeah. there is whipped cream on top, and the whipped cream also has some of the pumpkin spice that Ooh, is yummy. inside the My pie. My mouth is watering. Top. It's delicious. Yes. I'm getting hungry. <laughs> <laughs> Me too. <laughs> and that's looking good. So um, from the look in the oven, the bread has become crusty mm -hmm. and the stock has all been absorbed. Is it supposed to be like that? Yes. Okay. Yeah, that's okay. how it looks. Okay. It's mm -hmm. like a textural, Thanksgiving meal is textures. So it's crusty top, okay. kind of moist um, bread in the bottom that's flavored. Oh, that looks lovely. Yeah, so the gravy 
It's ready. It's pretty much ready. It's ready. <laughs> yeah. That was simple. Yeah. It's the, one of the last things you make. Um, one other dessert that we love to make on Thanksgiving is pecan pie. Oh, yes. Oh, yummy. Yes. So, with some maple syrup? Maple syrup. Or brown sugar, what? Brown sugar. Mm -hmm. Top it with pecans mm -hmm. in, in, a, in, a, in a pie crust. We don't get pecans here, so we make it using walnuts. Okay. Ah, a walnut pie. Yes. Make do. We can, we can try that too. <laughs> but I'm looking forward to that pumpkin pie. Pumpkin pie is one of my favorite desserts. Yeah. Okay, so now tell me about the different places that you've spent your Thanksgiving or your different assignments in different parts of the world because I believe I read your profiles and both of you have seen half the world already. <laughs> I've been doing this, yeah, for 23 years. Um, so my family, uh, were, we were in Ukraine, Barbados, Ooh. Beijing, China, Taiwan, and then most recently we were in Washington, D.C. Okay. So we were always together. So you must be multilingual also. Picked up a few words picked up, from Picked every... up a few languages <laughs> here and there. Uh, ch some Chinese, some Russian, okay. some Ukrainian, yeah. Okay. So I'm going to turn this off. Looks okay. like the gravy is done. Okay, done. Okay. And what about you, Reva? So, yes, I have spent time in various places mm. as well. I've been in for about 20 years. Um, and I've had to make vegetarian Thanksgiving dinners, which was a challenge, I will say. <laughs> and, um, and actually So what did vegan. you do instead of the turkey? Yeah, so a lot of vegetables, a lot of things like the vegetable or the green bean casserole, but when it was vegan, I couldn't even use the milk. Mm. So it was challenging, it was really challenging. Um, but uh, yeah, we always tried to find things that were local on the market. And then substitute. And then substitute. Yeah. So it takes creativity as cooking does. Yeah. So. so what about your uh, favorite cuisine from all over the world? What do you like to eat? Oh, uh, you can't. Uh, I, I love food. <laughs> okay, so you love to eat everything. I love to and eat everything. And what about Scott? <laughs> Same here. I, Same where, wherever I've lived, I've really enjoyed the food, whether it's hot pot in Beijing, the, okay. the dumplings so you don't in mind Taiwan. the spicy food in Karachi? Not no. at all. I love the spicy food here. Have you tried to cook something that you've learned abroad? Have you tried something for your family? Have you made something for so your family? We, my family and I spent a lot of time in East Asia. Okay. And so we, we've learned to make a few Chinese dishes, oh. Japanese dishes, oh. uh, mm. Korean dishes. Okay. Um, I'm hoping to learn how to make some Pakistan dishes yes. as well. Yes. Next time you come on my show, I will make you some Pakistani dish and dessert as well so that you can sample our cuisine also. I'd love to come back. Yeah. Fantastic. So now we'll take a short break. We'll clear up and Riva will take the break this time. चलो तो हम फिर मिलेंगे थोड़ी देर में आप देख रहे हैं मसाला टीवी और हम वापस आएंगे बहुत जल्दी में जी तो वेलकम बैक आप देख रहे हैं थैंक्स गिविंग स्पेशल का ये स्पेशल शो विद हर लवली गेस्ट हियर ऑन मसाला टीवी और टर्की इज रेडी सो इज द ग्रेवी एवरीथिंग लुक्स लवली आई कॉन्ट वेट टू डिग इन और ऑफकोर्स द कैसरोल भी है जिसमें बीन्स और सॉस था और मशरूम्स थे एंड ऑफकोर्स रिवा हैज़ बिन वेरी काइंड टू मेक दिस लवली पम्पिन पाई फॉर आस So Riva thank you so much again and a uh, very big thank you to both of you for sparing out the time coming on my show and sharing all these lovely thanksgiving recipes with us anything you want to say about our country our people well first i just i will say my mouth is watering that all looks delicious i can't wait to try it <laughs> i've really enjoyed my time in pakistan i've only been here a few months so i haven't seen a lot of the country but i just came back from a trip to northern sindh i was in okay. sakar and jakobabad last week I had a chance to see the countryside the rural areas meet with some students and uh, really impressed by um, what i've seen and here in karachi there's so much going on it's such a vibrant city yeah. a lot of energy uh, the arts the culture the music the food i really <laughs> enjoy my time here in karachi yeah. what about you reva वैसे तो ये मेरा सेकंड ईयर है यहां पर मैं इस्लामाबाद में थी एक साल के लिए और फिर यहां पर शिफ्ट हो गई ओके तो आई लव इट मुझे भी बहुत प्यार है पाकिस्तान के साथ आ, और इतना फ़र्क इतना फ़र्क नहीं है इंडिया से जैसे मैं इंडिया जाती रहती थी आ, और वहाँ पर भी सर्व किया वहाँ की अम्बे वही है। लो, लोग हैं वही खाना है ऑलमोस्ट वही कपड़े हैं पक्का <laughs> वैसे तो ये राजस्थान से है अच्छा। मगर ये यहाँ पर भी मिल जाएगा बिल्कुल <laughs> तो मेरे लिए घर है Okay, that's great to you. That's great to you. Okay, so tell me, do you have any hobbies? Are you pursuing anything apart from the job and all this? Well, I grew up in the state of Utah, near the mountains. I, I've always loved being outdoors and hiking and camping. Oh. I'm also a big sports fan, so okay. I, I grew up playing baseball, basketball, tennis. Uh, here in Pakistan, I'm learning to play cricket. Oh. We have a group that plays uh, at the U.S. consulate every Friday, so okay. I'm, I'm starting to. 
to, to play cricket, and um, I've also played softball here at the Karachi American School, which I really enjoy. Mm -hmm. And Riva? Yeah, so I actually am a yoga instructor, and I'm continuing to develop my practice. I've always really wanted to learn how to play tabla, oh, yeah. so I'm thinking about trying to find someone to teach me that here while I have a little bit more time in Pakistan. So yeah, I mean, I love hiking and the outdoors as well, but those are the two things that I'm focusing on right now while I'm in Pakistan. So has your family ever come to Pakistan? Have they ever visited? They would love to come, but they have not been able to visit. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I mean, as I was saying, my family is from Rajasthan, where my family speaks Marwari, um, and it is, we're so close to Pakistan. It's like, you know, that, that little border. That's the border. <laughs> Separates us, yes. sadly. Okay, so can't wait to, to dig into your uh, uh, pumpkin pie and taste yes. the different flavors because it's a lot of a cheese that we don't make. We make the kaddu from the kaddu, but we don't make the kaddu from the kaddu. We make the kaddu from the kaddu, but we don't make the pie from the kaddu. There is also a masala in it, but it's not so sweet. It's a little sweet. So you've made the base and then you've put the puree and then you've baked it? Yes. You've baked it for how long? Uh, for about 45 minutes. Okay, and then you let it cool and then you put, it, the, put then you the, the whipped, whipped cream, cream on, on top. It. Okay, mm -hmm. sounds great. Yes. So next time you come on my show, you'll be making that from scratch. Okay, <laughs> we'll do Thieke. it. Okay. <laughs> ठीक है? ठीक है। Okay, great. So Nazreen, अब हम एक छोटी सी break की तरफ चलते हैं। Break से वापस आएंगे, तो फिर और मज़ेद आपसे बातें करेंगे। हमारे साथ रहिए और देखते रहिए Thanksgiving special show of Food Diaries only on Masala TV. Green bean casserole, अच्छा। सब्ज़ फली 750 ग्राम, ताज़ा मशरूम में कप, पानी एक लीटर, दूध एक लीटर, मैदा दो कप, नमक हस्बे जायका, सफ़ेद प्याज पांच से सब्ज़ फली आठ मिनट ब्लांच करके पानी से निकाल कर एक तरफ रख दें पैन में मक्खन पिघला कर प्याज शामिल करके मिंट पर भूनें फिर मैदा शामिल करके पकाएं हसबे जायका नमक और काली मिर्च डाल दें अब इसमें मशरूम डाल दें आखिर में ब्लांच सब्ज़ फली मिलाएं और बेकिंग डिश में डाल दें एक डिग्री सेंटीग्रेड पर गर्म आवन में पैंतीस मिनट बेक करें और कद्दूकश चैडर चीज़ फैला कर डालें और पाँच से दस मिनट बेक करके सर्व कर दें थैंक्स गिविंग स्टफिंग अच्छा लॉन्ग ब्रेड दो अदद मक्खन छः खाने के चमचे प्याज चाप दो अदद बड़ी लहसन चार से छः जवे अंडे बड़े दो अदद मुर्गी की यखनी तीन से चार कप नमक हंसपे जायका ताज़ा पिसी काली मिर्च हंसपे जायका ताज़ा थाइम रोज मैरी पार्सले चंद पत्तियाँ खुश कौरीगानों से एज थोड़ा सा कुटी लाल मिर्च चुटकी भर करके एक सौ पचहत्तर डिग्री सेंटीग्रेड पर अवन गर्म कर लें बेकिंग डिश मक्खन से ग्रीस कर लें धीमी आंच पर तीन खाने के चमचे मक्खन पर गिलाकर प्याज सौते करें प्याज नरम हो जाए तो लहसन शामिल करके पकाएं जब खुशबू आने लगे तो हंसपे जायका नमक और काली मिर्च मिला के ठंडा होने दें एक प्याले में अंडे फेंट कर इसमें मुर्गी की यखनी कुटी लाल मिर्च नमक और काली मिर्च मिलाएं ब्रेड डेढ़ इंच के टुकड़ों में काट लें अब एक बड़े प्याले में यखनी वाला अमेजा प्याज वाला मिक्सचर और डबल रोटी मिलाकर एक तरफ रख दें जब तक यखनी अच्छी तरह जस्प हो जाए तैयार अमेजा बेकिंग डिश में डालें और मक्खन छोटे टुकड़ों में काट कर शामिल कर दें फॉइल लगा कर मिनट बेक करें फिर फॉइल हटा के गोल्डन और क्रिस्पी होने तक बेक करें स्टफिंग बेक्ड टर्की के साथ सर्व कर दें बेक्ड टर्की अज्जा टर्की खाल समेत एक अदर नरम मक्खन एक कप नमक हंसपे जायका ताज़ा पिसी काले मिर्च हंसपे जायका ताज़ा रोज मैरी थोड़ी सी ताज़ा थाइम थोड़ी सी ताज़ा पार्सले थोड़ी सी खुश्क सेज आधा चाय का चमचा खुश कौरीगानो आधा चाय का चमचा प्याज कटी तीन से चार अदर लहसन छः से आठ जबे टर्की गर्म पानी में नमक हल करके ठंडा होने दें फिर नमक वाले पानी में टर्की डाल दें पानी में टर्की मुकम्मल डूब जाए 24 घंटे के लिए टर्की रेफ्रिजरेट कर दें रोस्ट करने से पहले नमक वाले पानी से टर्की निकाल के ताज़ा पानी से धोकर अंदर और बाहर से अच्छी तरह खुश कर लें गर्दन और कलेजी वगैरह निकाल दें टर्की पर अच्छी तरह मक्खन मलें और नमक पिसी काले मिर्च छिड़क दें ताज़ा और खुश्क हब्स मक्खन के साथ टर्की में रख दें बेकिंग ट्रे में टर्की प्याज और लहसन रख दें एक सौ पिछहत्तर डिग्री सेंटीग्रेड पर गर्म अवन में बेक करें जब टर्की पानी छोड़ना शुरू करें तो 15 से 20 मिनट बाद दही पानी टर्की पर डालते रहें पैंतालीस मिनट बेकिंग के बाद टर्की पलटें और वापस बेक होने दें अगर टर्की बाहर से ब्राउन होना शुरू हो जाए तो अल्यूमिनियम फॉइल से ढाँप कर तीस ऐसी पैंतालीस मिनट बेक करें मीट थर्मामीटर रान में डालकर टेम्परेचर चेक करें गोश्त का टेम्परेचर पिछहत्तर डिग्री सेंटीग्रेड होने का मतलब है गोश्त पक चुका जब टेम्परेचर अड़सठ से 70 डिग्री सेंटीग्रेड हो जाए तो टर्की अवन से निकाल के 30 मिनट ठंडी होने दें कार्विंग करके ग्रेवी और साइड डिश के साथ सर्व कर दें
जी वेलकम बैक आप देख रहे हैं ये थैंक्स गिविंग स्पेशल शो ऑफ फूड डायरीज ओनली ऑन मसाला टीवी और हम सब के हाथों में ये मज़ेदार सा पम्पकिन पाए आ चुका है हमने इसको काट लिया है एंड वी आर गोइंग टू हैव दिस लवली पम्पकिन पाए नाउ आई होप यू ऑल एंजॉय इट द स्पाइस इज अर डिलीशियस आई लव इट Maybe did a great job with this pumpkin yes, pie. Yes, we did. It turned out. I'm happy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, and uh, I think it's time to end our show as well. Mm -hmm. Thank you both so much. It's been a great show, and you can watch it on Thanksgiving Day with your families. Yes. And um, before you leave our country, I would like to invite you once more to make something different. I would love to show. come back. Thanks so much okay. for having us today. And Reba, if you can also make it, that would be great. I would love it. Yeah, I would love to say thank you to all the people I've met here in Pakistan. Everyone has been so welcoming and hospitable. Happy Thanksgiving, everyone. And Reba? Yes. Thank you so much. The hospitality of Pakistanis is unmatched. I wish everyone a happy Thanksgiving and I hope that everyone has something to be thankful for this year. Okay ji, so a big thank you to uh, Scott and Riva again for coming and sharing these lovely recipes with us. Meri aur aapki mulaqat hogi ek aur episode mein dekhte rahiye Food Diaries on Masala TV. Happy Thanksgiving everyone. Bye bye. Allah Hafiz. Bye bye. Bye bye.